This song is called Brave. It's all about how God's love makes us brave. We're gonna start by singing, No, I won't be afraid, for you are with me. Let's go. No, I won't be afraid. You are with me. You are right beside me. of the Bible, Baby Moses. This is Moses. Hey Moses was a descendant of Joseph's brother, Levi. Hey. Joseph and his brothers had many children and grandchildren who lived happily in Egypt. Eventually, a new pharaoh came to power who knew nothing of Joseph or what he had done. This pharaoh feared the Israelites because there was a great number of them living in Egypt, so he wanted to put a stop to their prosperity. Pharaoh made the Israelites slaves. He made them work long, hard hours building up Egyptian cities. But his plan didn't work, and the Israelites grew more in number and in strength. Eek. So Pharaoh made a rule that no Israelite boy would be allowed to live in Egypt. This is where Moses' story begins. You see, when Moses was born, his mother saw that he was a special baby. Hmm. And she kept him hidden for three months. Ah. 
but when she could no longer keep him a secret, she made a basket and put him in the Nile River among the reeds. Moses' sister stayed to watch what would happen to her baby brother, and soon the Pharaoh's daughter came to the edge of the river. When she saw the basket, hey! she sent her servant to get it. When she saw the baby, she felt sorry for him, Aww. thinking he must be an Israelite baby who wasn't supposed to live. <laughs> Excuse me. Then Moses' sister asked the princess if she would like her to find an Israelite woman to take care of the baby. So Moses' sister went and got her mother. Moses' own mother took care of him until he was old enough to live in the Pharaoh's house, where the princess adopted him as her son. And so, Moses, an Israelite boy who wasn't supposed to live, became the adopted grandson of the Pharaoh and lived in the palace as God prepared him for a great destiny that was only just starting to unfold. Hi, I'm Joey. Uh, and I'm uh, Gus, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the Scuppertin Reptile Reserve. Today, we are going to study this little guy right here. His name's TikTok. He is an American alligator and he has a super strong bite, stronger than a lion. Ah, what? Ah, I didn't know that. Ah. Gus, you don't have to be afraid. He's amazing. Look at he just likes hanging out. He chills by the water, and he can hold his breath for up to five hours. Wow, that's a really cool alligator fact, but can we just put him away now? Uh, and maybe just put all the animals away so we don't have to be close to them all, uh, ever. Gus, I thought that's what we wanted to come to the reptile reserve for. We have to be close to them to study them and learn about them. I mean, I wanted to help, but I didn't think I would have to be so close to the alligators, and I'm so scared of alligators and snakes and lizards and pretty much everything in here. Gus, Gus, look it, it's gonna be okay. TikTok is a baby alligator. And see, he has tape on his mouth, so huh. there's no way he's gonna hurt you. Uh, how could you know that? Well, I know that because they have a super strong bite, but once it's closed down with this tape, it doesn't take much to hold it down, so I think you're gonna be safe, trust me. Trust you? What does it mean to trust? To trust means that you have to believe that someone's gonna do what they say they're going to do. Oh, so I can trust you to keep me safe from TikTok. Well, yeah, but I can let you down and sometimes people can let you down, but there's someone who's never gonna let you down. Oh, who's that? Well, God, and God will always do what he says he's going to do. And he promised to take care of you and protect you. Even when we don't know what's gonna happen, we can trust God. So I can trust God even when I feel scared or when I don't know what's going to happen? Yes, you can. Oh, well that's great, how do you know that? Well, because of a story in the Bible about Moses. Now when Moses was just a baby, God took care of him and made sure that Moses was protected when he was in a basket in the river. Wait, he was just floating in the river as a little baby? <laughs> yeah, I know, it's kind of dangerous. Mm. Kind of like hanging out with an alligator, but God took care of him and he's gonna take care of us. Now that story about Moses shows us that even when we don't know what's going to happen, God does and we can trust him. Okay, that makes me feel a little better. Good, now do you wanna learn something else about TikTok? Uh, okay. He has a lot of sharp teeth. Now me and you Gus, we have 32 teeth. Uh -huh. TikTok, he has 74 to 80 teeth. <sighs> That's a lot of teeth. Yeah, do you wanna see? Let's check. Oh, nope, nope, I'm good. Okay. Fine, we'll look at it later. But hey, it's time to feed TikTok a snack. So thanks for joining us at the Scuppertin Reptile Reserve. And remember, when you don't know what's gonna happen, you can trust God. He loves you so much. And so do we. See you guys later. Bye. Say bye, TikTok. <laughs> <laughs>